Advances in Health, I'm Rebecca Stewart. So many people in their lives deal with a thyroid issue. Now the thyroid does so much to regulate your body, metabolism, growth, development, and often you don't know what it does until you have an issue. Dr. Carrie Carcello is the only fellowship trained endocrine surgeon with the Hartford Healthcare Medical Group. So thank you so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. Take us through, when does someone know I have a thyroid issue? There's a lot of different thyroid issues and some of those re require surgical intervention and some maybe just medical. Uh, most of what I'm gonna see is something that's gonna require a surgical intervention, mm -hmm. which may be someone who presents with a thyroid nodule, for example. What are the kinds of symptoms? So if somebody has a nodule, how scared are they typically? So they're pretty scared when their you know, primary care doctor or maybe their endocrinologist tells them that they have a nodule because initially they may think, is this a cancer? Um, and in all of honesty, the majority of thyroid nodules are benign up to 95% of the time. Okay, great. Um, sometimes though, we need to evaluate them further um, based on the features that we see. Usually patients will end up getting an ultrasound. Mm -hmm. um, and based on those features and maybe the size of the nodule, sometimes we'll need to do a biopsy to get more information because there are about 5% of the time that people will have a thyroid cancer. And we were talking that there is annual surgery surveillance, but people do really well after this. The prognosis for the majority of thyroid cancers, you know, papillary thyroid cancer and follicular thyroid cancer, the five-year survival rate is 98%, so they do have an excellent prognosis in most situations. All right, wonderful. Thank you so much, Dr. Carrie Carcello. If you'd like to learn more information, head to WTNH.com slash advances in health.